in the light of the 21st century. Get ready for the future. Power up. With guaranteed low prices in every department at Fry's Electronics. This AMD Duran based PC only $229.99. Get one hour of never before seen Matrix footage, now available for all platforms. This Canon full feature mini DB camcorder, only $997. Remember, your best buys are always at Fry's. Guaranteed. Hello everyone, we are here at the abandoned Fries Electronics in Wilsonville, Oregon. So let's check this place out, shall we? By the way, this building is available. If you want to buy it, then call those numbers. This parking lot is huge. No cars at all. It's also kind of sketchy as heck. The signs are covered by types. He clearly would have said Fries Electronics. There used to be graffiti everywhere. The entrance is boarded up. That's the all store hours. Hmm, I doubt the door is unlocked. What a bummer. Here's the old car corral. So anyway, I'm going to share about the history of this building. This store opened in September 1992 as an incredible universe. And then in 1997, it got rebranded as Fry's Electronics. Finally, in February 2021, it has shut down for good. Obviously, all of the other Fry's Electronics locations are out of business. I used to come here many times when Fry's was open a long time ago. I remember I would play one of the video games, Chaos, for a long time. Uh, what a memories. So many boarded up windows. Not surprised about it. Here's another old car coil. Hmm, I don't know if we'll be able to take a peek on the inside. I'll figure it out. Yep, there's a way to see the inside. Just barely. Nothing much in here. Just feel like charm. There's an office chair straight ahead. The floor doesn't look clean at all. The last time I went to Fife when they were in business was either 2018 or 2019. He wasn't busy at all. Yep, one of the windows got busted. That's not okay. Right after Fife closed down, this store was liquidating fixtures and I was able to go inside. I did have the chance to film the interior of the building. But unfortunately, a few minutes later, one of the angry liquidators saw me doing that and told me not to record it. It just came out of nowhere, so I had to stop it. Honestly, he didn't have to be so firm. Here we got the old mobile installation tuner. Sadly, I don't have the footage interior anymore because it was too short of what happened with the liquidator. The good thing is that I documented this building as it is still abandoned to this day. My lord, look at these broken appliances. Just wow. 
Unbelievable. I'm pretty sure they were part of fights. That's a lot of damages so far. Here's the old loading dock. There are more down there too. Wow, it's a complete mess in here. It seriously needs to be cleaned up as soon as possible. I have no idea how long this building will stay empty. Probably for a long time, I guess. I see there's a lot of cowboys in the left. They were never thrown away, which I find it surprising. I still kind of miss going to fries. Here are the extra loading docks. And that's about it. That's gonna wrap up for real. Make sure you give it a like, comment, share, video and so, and until next time, peace out.